Back now with the nail biter that went late into the night. Two fierce competitors battling it out round after round. The audience spellbound and millions more watching at home hooked on every word. Here's NBC's Joe Fryer. Cooper Komatsu. Without Los fail, Angeles. the script's national spelling bee brings the that drama. <laughs> well, even the Super Bowl can turn into a boring blowout. This is guaranteed heart thumping tension. Chaoberine. Word by word, they dwindled until only two remained. Nihar Jenga, an 11 year old with a surprising swagger. C. Shuck, is this an Irish prime minister? It is. And J. Ram Hathwar, whose brother won in 2014. So, no pressure. Championship blood, J. Ram Hathwar. Because the B crowned co champs the previous two years, this time organizers made the final rounds last even longer with words so hard you should read them so I don't have to pronounce them. Yet somehow the boys survived to the final round where J. Ram got the word Feldenkrais. That's correct. And Nihar got F. T. Gazelsha. That is correct. And once again, the word champion has two spellers. We both were trying to encourage each other to and possibly become co-champions. I'm just speechless. I can't say anything. I mean, I'm only in fifth grade. In any other competition, such a shared moment of victory might seem wrong, but here it's hard to imagine a sweeter ending. Joe Fryer, NBC News.